Hi, I'm Lise Colucci, and I am a life coach who is here to help you with everything regarding understanding and healing from toxic relationships, narcissism, and all of that that goes with it. Okay, so first of all, hit the thumbs up, hit subscribe, and I have a question for you today. So questions have the capability to open up the possibility for change. Questions are, they're your key to getting out of the judgment and the reinforced stuff that's been put on you by toxic people and that you've taken on yourself and that the world has put on you, right? Questions keep us in curiosity and open-mindedness toward what else is there, what else is possible for your life, even when you are stuck or cannot leave a toxic relationship. So my question today for you is if you are in a toxic relationship, if you are dealing with toxic people, or if you are still having a lot of engagement with a toxic person, like a toxic parent that has you enmeshed or whatever it is, where you have toxic people in your life that you feel are have more control of your life than they should, what is it that happens in this situation for you that you feel affects your life the most and that you would like to make a change in your life for yourself if you are in these in one of these relationships or or have these people around then it is affecting you what if anything in your life takes you out of it for a little while takes you away from the stress and the trauma of dealing with these people what healthy things let me rephrase that gets you moving forward and where do you feel like you would like to make change where are you stuck what within that relationship has you engaging deeply with the toxic person where's the hook so that you can move forward with your life people are asking me and when i make videos about when you can't get out they're asking me for ways to help them they're asking me for ways in which to cope and ways in which to not only survive this but actually begin healing so here's the thing know that you're in a situation that is going to keep your cortisol levels up your re-traumatizations happening the the toxic behavior is going to continue towards you and it's not going to be the kind of healing that you would have if you did not have this in your life okay it's just not impossible but but very very challenging to live in toxic situations and be like perfectly okay i mean that would be kind of like pretending it isn't there right i don't know that that's necessarily the healthiest thing so what can you do for yourself and what questions do you have that i can make short videos to help you personally get through this are there anything is there anything i can uh talk to you about let me know please put it in the main comments in the form of a question or a couple questions and i will make shorts to go along with this video about how to help yourself while you are still in these toxic relationships to help yourself begin healing but that's really personal the thing is it is very personal the reasons people stay the way they feel about themselves the way they feel about the situation the way they feel about the toxic person or the relationship itself or the dynamics of what else is going on in their life is going to be very individual and very personal. So if you are uncomfortable putting anything in the comments, please just send me an email. You can find me in the main description of every video. So I will try to do those kind of regularly so we can get some help out there. It's been a huge request, but I feel like making just big long videos isn't enough and we need some actual back and forth dialogue about this maybe a live stream when people know it's on so they can show up but really the shorts would help so let me know what i can do to help with that and any questions you have regarding healing specifically as you as specific as you can as detailed as you can so that it might help you and others all right I will hopefully be hearing from you soon and we will be talking about this ongoing. Okay. You guys take care, hit the thumbs up, hit subscribe. If you need coaching, group coaching or peer support, check out the description of every video. There's lots of information there and you guys be well, take care. Bye-bye.